America will have nearly 50 million people with disabilities in, in, in the next decade. Unfortunately, with that number of people with disabilities, there's no single specialty, there's no single specialist that can actually manage the whole population. We need to develop practitioners that care, practitioners that want to improve the overall health of people, the well-being. We need to figure out how to accommodate this spectrum of people. It requires a, a total turnover of how we educate our dental student that that it's no longer a special clinic, a special, a special dentist, it's them. And we're going to make that part of our core curriculum. Our, our students will spend time working with sick patients, with intellectually disabled, with psychiatric patients, with aging patients, with young and old persons with disabilities of all forms, developmental or acquired. This is a, this is a core item to, to be a human nonetheless be a great dentist. Penn Dental Medicine needs to make a substantial investment in faculty and facility to be able to bring this vision to, to reality. It requires rehabilitating a clinical facility, making wide corridors, giant doorways, spaces that stretches and wheelchair lifts and wheelchairs can be brought in and, and work in. Renovations are expensive. We need to be funded. We want to bring in the very best faculty in the world. We need to set up endowed professorships that will enable us to maintain and keep the very best leaders in clinical dentistry. And we need to have funds that will help bring people from around the world that need to be educated into our center to make this work and we look for this facility to treat patients without regard for their ability to pay for the work that's done. We need funding to help support this.